there everyone! John and I are walking to Nosh inside of Cactus Pete's. Cause what do they have, John? A foot long hot dog and we're gonna mukbang it. So when we get it ordered, we're gonna eat it and you'll see it. It's huge! Okay, it's closed right now, so we're going to get a drink. Hi there, we're at Nosh and we ordered um, the foot long hot dog and it's not ready. It'll be about 10 minutes. Oh, wow, we're waiting. Let's have us a delicious, humongous eclair. They're so warm. I'm gonna have to eat it with my hands. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna go find some silverware. Okay, silverware! I'm so excited. This looks so delicious. Oh my gosh. I never really have dessert first, but since we're gonna be waiting for the big old foot long wiener, we're gonna have to buy our time somehow. So, this is Nosh in Jackpot, Nevada. This is where we live. Not in Nosh, though. We just live here, but. And this thing it looks so. Okay. Well, some of it looks like you're supposed to use your fingers. That's pudding. Johnny wants a bite. I can tell he's looking at like, really, you're gonna eat it like that? <laughs> so while we're here eating dessert, why don't you comment down below and let me know what your favorite treat, favorite dessert is. Like it's falling apart here. You want some, John? This eclair is made right. The Bavarian cream on the inside is really flavorful. It's perfectly creamy. It's got whipped cream on it as well. And it's heavy whipped cream. It's not like cool whip. Um, the egg part or the breading tube or whatever you call it. <laughs> Sicko. <laughs> um, it's perfectly flavored. It's got that really good egg flavor, like kind of like the way, the way French toast tastes. It's fluffy. Then it's topped with this. It's got some sugar on it, chocolate leaves, and oh, 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 and white chocolate. So we've got chocolate and white chocolate. It's 
the special treat. This one was only three ninety nine. I would totally charge like six bucks for a big old eclair <clears throat> like this, especially with cactus peas. Everything here is usually overpriced. Go to find such a delicacy for so cheap. That's awesome. You know what my favorite dessert is? A chocolate sheet cake. It's got to have a really tender, moist chocolate cake with a. It's kind of like a chocolate drizzle frosting, not not the fluffy shortening of sugar mix. Did you like it once more? Staring at my dessert. <laughs> you want some with the chocolate stuff on the top? You like the pudding? It's good, huh? You like it when John wants some? Because then he's sort of participating. <laughs> you gotta bring it over here a little more. It's closer to me. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> it means he likes the eclair. It doesn't necessarily mean he likes to be on TV or on the camera. I have a hard time being on camera. It's scary as all crap. Because, you know, people get to see you, every side of you, every portion of you that, that you don't want people to see when you're taking pictures that you can easily hide on the snap. Bye, Johnny. <laughs> mm. That's like seriously the best dessert I've had here. Okay, so there's a big buffet that they have here. It's twenty nine dollars. It's like Vegas style buffet, and it's so good. They have. Lobster. We were lobster. No, just crab legs, huh? Yeah. Crab legs and shrimp. Different kinds of shrimp, like fill apart shrimp or fried shrimp. We had shrimp scampi. You know, I'm starting to sound like Bubba. <laughs> um, is it Bubba gum? Bubba something. They have all sorts of shrimp stuff. Then they had, um, what's my favorite steak stuff called? Oh, prime rib. Yeah, prime rib. But they had these little steak medallions that were even better than that, which was awesome. Their dessert menu, like their dessert bar, is so massive. Like, I think that's what I would pay that all that money for is all the desserts because they have like creme brulee and different kinds of cakes. And, Flam and flam with chocolate cake and cheesecake and gelato ice cream flavors. Somebody there just carving it out for you and stuff. You want some more? This one's fine. I gave you the best piece. I like, gave you the part where it had all the chocolate. The best part of chocolate. This has some chocolate on it. All right. So like the style here is Vegas quality, which is good because it's $29 and that's Vegas prices. Is that good? I can't get that stuff. Alright, so we're waiting for the hot dog. It's going to be massive. You're going to love it. I'm going to have a sip of my Coke. My diet Coke. Oh, but with ice. They got um, 
coffee at that machine if you want coffee. Lots of powder, creamer, sugar, and stuff, so if you need to stay up all night. They got Coke, Diet Coke, Mr. Pib, Root Beer, and I think like an orange soda. It's awesome. Yeah, I'm excited for that hot dog. I'm ready for the wiener. <laughs> John's like, I wish you were that excited. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> TMI, Amber. <laughs> Alright. Got our food. I was stretching out this. There goes. <laughs> Wiener time! Oh yeah! <clears throat> A big hot dog. Oh my gosh. And look at the bun, it's like homemade. See that? This isn't like something you get from the bun section of Walmart. It's like homemade buns. And then they've got kettle fries. Oh, my winner is showing us. <laughs> That's what he said. <laughs>
bun is so good. Hot dog is super hot. <laughs> So, tell me which casino is your favorite, if you've been to Vegas or, or throughout the nation, what is your favorite casino? That's who I should go to, whether it's like a slot for loose or they have the best buffet or whatever perk it is that you like about it. Maybe they've got like the best um, pool or something for kids to play at every buffet. Or mine's probably the obby and lot point. What do you like about the obby? It's a good motel. A hotel. Casino's nice, big. Buffet is good. Good cafe. Plus, it's right on the river. So, if the pool's too crowded, you can go swim in the marina. <laughs> what was your favorite things that were in the buffet that you had? Um, the breakfast part, uh, they had both uh, chip beef and corned beef hash, which is navy food. Um, the prime rib is good, seafood is good there, everything is good. Did you like their cottage cheese? The horseradish is really popular. <laughs> we went to that buffet with my sister, Fran, and she brought back this whole bowl full of cottage cheese. <laughs> and she went to take a bite and she's like, oh! That is not cottage cheese, and I wouldn't if it was horseradish sauce. She had filled a whole entire bowl up with a horseradish it was pure sauce. Ground pure horse, horseradish. Pure ground horseradish. And it, looked, it did look like cottage cheese. I gave her that, so. That was really funny. My favorite thing is the same buffet style now. They have. They have the um, the ice cream and oh slam slam bay. So they put fruit and like a liqueur and they fry it in a pan with with fire. And it tastes so good with ice cream. Is that normal to have slam bay with ice cream? Is that how people usually do it? Yeah. Excuse me. <laughs> um, and okay, so not in the buffet, but in the cafe there, they have, and it's funny, we just ate an eclair and we're talking about it. They have eclairs the size of football. And they're $3. Was it $3? For five. I think it's three bucks. was like this. The girl was like this white. Brown. It was really good. What else do we like here? They always have really good pancakes. But I find it easy to be satisfied with pancakes because a lot of people make them really good. They have a $2.99 breakfast special. Is that just eggs and hash browns and stuff? Toast. Yeah, it's two eggs, hash browns, beef. 
I don't remember when we went to the station um, in Las Vegas. I thought we liked that buffet. Alice Station. The Alice Station in Vegas. Didn't we like that buffet? Yeah, it was okay. Circus Circus used to be really good with that. I don't love Circus Circus. Their buffet used to only be like three dollars. I remember going. My mom took me. It was, it was really cheap. We'd all go and eat. It was super cheap. The last time we went to Circus Circus, though, like their sausage was like baked sausage, and their eggs were like baked eggs. It wasn't flavorful. It was nasty. Remember that? Did you try it? I love yeah. it. But I love Circus Circus for the the acrobats and that kind of stuff they have going on on up in the midway for kids. That's really fun. I also really like their their carousel room, the gambling carousel room where you can step on the carousel and gamble on those games. I think that's so cool. And you get a buttload of tickets of, um, at the midway and then there's like a lot of games. And you win easily on the on those games, like on the midway arcade games for the kids and stuff. And that's really fun. Parking sucks. You gotta walk yeah, five miles awful. to get inside the casino for the parking structure. How's the win? Satisfying. Down to the left of the court. <laughs> I have to take the fries home to the kids. I'm not going to be able to eat it all. I think the hot dog is all beef. Like, it tastes like an all beef dog. Like Nathan's hot dog times 10 in one, in one dog. You <laughs> got 10 Nathan's dogs in one big winner. <laughs> Tampers and Diet Coke. Wash this down. Hot dogs make me burp. Excuse me. If you look at this bread, I think you shouldn't expect it. It's kind of yellow, like the ones you do get at Walmart and stuff. But I promise this is the weight of it and everything. This is so homemade. Or homemade somewhere, maybe that's not everything. I don't know cooked it or something, but it wasn't even, so you could tell it wasn't like perfectly. They probably have like a bun maker or something back there. You know how you see all the hostess hot dog buns and they're all like uniform and stuff and there isn't any excess anywhere. There's some excess on this. It's good. Oh <laughs> I got juice dripping down my face. A weird sauce. It was hot. So it was hot hot winter. Warm winter leakage. Winter leakage. <laughs> That's fine! With fried sauce. I'm not going to be able to eat for weeks. <laughs> oh my heaven. John, your wiener is hiding in my box. <laughs> I have not eaten anything by it. It's in this box. In this box. So that's at Nosh. Nosh is like a snack place. But they got like a bucket of chicken, you can get you can get pizza, you can get hot dogs. And I never thought that I'd see such huge hot dogs. Do you have corn dogs and stuff here too or no? They have soup, they have some pre-made salad, pre-made hoagie, muffins, <laughs> brownies, cookies, um, what are those? Like, um, kind of like bear claws, but they're croissant fish, more croissant, like, um, excuse me, what's that, um, is it a croissant? Like turnover type things. 
They're like turnovers on me. Kids are gonna love this. Mm -hmm. fries. It's called kettle fries. They remind me of my high school's um, cafeteria fries, which were my favorite. Like I would, I would like those over McDonald's or Burger King. Burger King changed out their fries a few years ago. Instead of sending them like the gold Yukon fries from Arctic Circle, which are really good, they're like good fries. They're like golden, buttery, salty flavor. And the textures are really good. These are actually kind of small, so like my school cafeteria's fries are even better than this. They were a little bit thicker, so like we got more meat in the middle that was tender. <laughs> Potato meat. <laughs> that was tender in the center. But for how skinny these fries are, they're pretty tender in the center still, even though they're really skinny and crispy on the outside. So that's how we like mosh. I like the pots. Isn't that fun? Comment down below. Let me know what um where your favorite hot dogs are. What your favorite hot dog eating places like Wiener Schnitzel or Arctic Circle or where else has hot dogs? McDonald's used to have hot dogs. <laughs> Maverick or the different um, gas station convenience store type hot dogs. Let me know where you, what kind of hot dogs you like the most. Um, even if they're ones you make yourself, you buy Nathan's or Bar S or Oscar Mayer or if there's certain, like a certain brand of hot dogs you like. I don't know what brand that was, but it was super good. I think it was 100% beef. Like it seemed like it was really meaty. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. If you didn't, that's okay. Uh, give it a thumbs down or, or say nothing, I guess. I don't care. Um, and stay tuned, we got some more videos, eating eating show videos, mukbang videos I guess, and um, story times, and music, and all sorts of stuff coming up, so hope you had a good day. Did you like my Jeff Lepper shirt? Got it. My husband picked it out from the Goodwill yesterday, 50 cents, it was pink tag Tuesday, and he picked it out actually for my son, but I stole it because I'm like, no, I'm wearing that, I want it, so... But not bad for 50 cents, right? Alright, you guys have a good day. See you next time. Bye.